Welcome to Crash Racer. Today we are playing Formula Retro Racing World Tour and we're going to have another go at the arcade mode. We're going to pick another track. We're doing all of these tracks on expert mode, so some of them are really tough. Let's give Snowdonia Drift a go. See how difficult this one is. Snowdonia Drift then. Rolling start as most of these are. Off we go, and I'll tell you what, there's a massive gap from ourselves forward to the uh, next car in front. Normally you're in quite a tight sort of formation, but uh, the pack's got a massive lead on us already for us to catch up. 20th place of 20th, of course we start four laps, and we've got the timer up in the centre that ticks down. We've got to uh, overtake as many cars as we can and get across the checkpoints before that timer gets down to zero hopefully complete the four laps and hopefully see if we can get a, a win as well as I say expert mode in this arcade mode is is really tough on some of these tracks so difficult tough to get a win but on a lot of them also very tough to even complete the the four laps without the the timer ticking down to zero let's see how we get on on this one now we're up and amongst the traffic yeah that's uh, that's unusual that that start that we were so far behind the uh, the rest of the pack to start with got to try and make as few mistakes of course as possible every time we hit another car or if we run off into the gravel at the side of the track it really slows us down can't afford to do that too much up into 10th place then really nice track this one a lot of long sweeping left hand corners a lot of those you can take full speed but then there's a couple of really tight right hand corners as well just need to slow down and try and get the uh, the right lines through those corners where possible okay up the straight then for the end of the first lap and can we get in the slipstream here yeah get one more place as we come across the line up into eighth place then rest of the car strung out quite well in front of us and the leader is quite a long way ahead so we need some good laps here I think to uh, to try and close up yeah as I was saying some of the some of these uh, some of these arcade modes on expert it's a real challenge getting across the checkpoints before the timer expires this one doesn't seem too bad actually very often on some of the other tracks it's down to the you know within the last five seconds before you're going across the checkpoint this time whereas uh, the timer seems quite generous on this one. Sixth place then. And we squeeze up the inside, a little bit of contact as we go past, but not too bad. Break into this tight right hand corner and accelerate out of it. around this long sweeping left hand corner now before we uh, get back onto the start finish straight try and get in the slipstream here and then we've got to slip past up into fourth then just looking on the map leader is still quite a distance ahead let's see where they uh, cross the line and where we are at that point behind so I would say they're crossing the line now so that's sort of the uh, the gap they've got on us time is about nine seconds as we cross the finish line two laps to go now third place just ahead of us reeling them in slowly second just about in sight as well ahead can we sneak up the inside just got to watch they don't close the gap no we're all right we're through up into second place then, no third place sorry, chasing down second place <coughs> quite a distance ahead I'm slightly concerned here that we're going to have enough time to uh, catch the leader give it a best shot though one minute 39 was our last lap which was quite a good one I think so if we can get a timing in around that again might give ourselves a chance. First, that was a 1.41. Obviously, with the rolling start, you should get really a similar lap time for the for the first lap as well. But of course, the first lap normally is the trickiest because you're overtaking so many cars on that first lap. 
Right, let's get in the slipstream, see if we can get a good pass. Again, I can sneak up the inside, hopefully they don't close the gap. No, we're through. Through and up into second place then. Now, where's that leader? Can I see them? I'm not sure if I can quite see them just in the distance. Again, let's have a look where they are in relation to us as they cross the line. Up onto the straight now then. That's them across the line now. So we're definitely closer than we were last lap, but still quite a bit of a gap to try and pull back on this last lap. I can't afford to make any mistakes here. There are some back markers. I don't know if the if the leader or ourselves is going to catch them. Hopefully not. That's the last thing we need. There's the leader. I can visually see them probably for the first time. Right, can we reel them in? Still a lot of work to do here. Can't make any mistakes here on these corners. If I get one of these lines wrong and just get our wheels over the gravel to slow us down, that will probably be any chance of a win lost. Starting to reel them in now. This is not going to be easy at all. This is going to be close. This is going to be really close. Okay, onto this tight section and now onto the long sweeping left hand corner. We've got to get on the back of this car, either on this long sweeping left hand corner or on this straight. Got to get in close. If I can get close, of course, I'll get a little bit of slipstream and I should be able to get past. We are gaining. We are gaining just as we come out the last section. Can I slip up the inside or there? Weaving about slightly. A little bit of slipstream. Right, I've got one chance. If I hit the back of them, we are done for. We're going to get past. I think we're through. There they are. Yeah, we're through. <laughs> Talk about close. That was uh, about as close as you like, right on the final straight before we overtook them. That was great fun, though. Really enjoyed these arcade challenges. Another win, though, this time at Snowdonia Drift. Well that's the end of the video, if you liked it please like it and subscribe and see you soon.